Hi, I'm Eric Brooks, and I am a member of the National Committee of the Communist Party USA. I've been a member of this party for now well over 45 years, and I love it. It has been a source of tremendous joy and tremendous stability in struggle for my whole life. Stability in struggle is important because the struggle is the, the fight for change is a long-term fight, and if we want to, f to win change, we have to be in it for the long term. A lot of people are confused and scared after the Trump election, and there's a lot of questions about how did this happen, who voted for Trump, was there actually a mandate for Trump's agenda. Um, and I want to just remind people that actually a, a minority of everybody who could vote voted for Trump. That's just the truth. I also want to remind people that we know who Trump is. We know what he wants to do. He's been telling us what he wants to do for a while. The way to stop him in his tracks, the way to totally derail the Trump agenda, the way to fight for working class needs and working class power, even in a Trump-dominated administration, is to build mass movements. Um, when you have a working class that is basically starving and a tiny, tiny group of 62 people that have more than the 300 million people in the United States combined, then there's a inequality that is really destructive and toxic to our world. We also have a toxic environment when it comes to education because our education is being so politicized and so skewed into diff into a uh, ultra right kind of um, discourse on distortions of history and things like that. That to have a scientific based party like the Communist Party, and by scientific based I mean based in objective reality collectively understood. When you have that kind of a organization that you can fight with, then you can fight much harder and with more joy and with more consistency than you ever could by yourself. The most wonderful thing about the Communist Party is the people who are trained over time to work very closely together in collectives and committees um, so that they have the power of collective thinking and collective resources to bring to each of the struggles that they engage with in their local areas. When I think about who I want to join the fight with me, I want every single person in the working class who has a desire to work with other people in common struggle for the best interest of our class and of this party to join this party. The working class is a very, in the United States is huge and varied and has so many different wonderful skills that, and it, it's really sad because a lot of people don't really see that they have skills. They don't understand that being an administrator or being a garbage man or uh, being a lab tech or being um, a uh, network tech, that all those things are very powerful skills that will also be needed by movement struggles. We're part of a global communist movement or mo global movement for socialism that has the same, for the most part, they have the same uh, goals and we are honored 
to be able to provide a home for so many people who want to fight for change together.